There's a brand new Scion coming to showrooms this fall and it's called the IA. As you can see, this is Scion's first ever sedan. But if it's starting to look a little bit familiar to you, there's an awfully good reason because this is in fact a rebadged version of the Mazda 2 that you've probably already seen. Toyota formed an alliance with that company to give Scion some sorely needed product, even if it does have an oh so Kodo look and feel. What am I talking about? Well, the body lines, tail lights, and interior pieces all look distinctly like the Mazda product that this car is based on. But it goes deeper than that because it gets a 1.5 liter four cylinder engine that sends 106 horsepower to the front wheels through either a six speed manual or a six speed automatic. According to the company, it should be capable of returning up to 33 miles per gallon in the city or 42 on the highway and 37 on the whole. Now, Scion's sales scheme hasn't changed, which means that the company is offering a single trim level in this car meant to help customers avoid having to haggle with salespeople when they come in to buy a new car. Accordingly, the car is outfitted with 16-inch alloy wheels, a push-button ignition system, collision mitigation, and infotainment, all as standard. And that last bit is especially important because it means that the latest Scion product gets the same infotainment system that we've seen in cars like the Mazda 3, the Mazda 6, and the CX-5 that we have been particularly fond of. Now, the company hasn't said exactly what it plans to charge for the new IA, but they promise that it's going to cost somewhere around $16,000 when it shows up in showrooms later this year.